Hey guys, Chastity Snowden here with the FLA Movement coming to you real, live, raw. Right after a busy trip, gone away for the weekend, went to Wisconsin to see my godson, River, and see Coach Emma and Ryan, and rushing back in, came back in, flew in on a Monday, and I know you guys have had these kind of trips where you fly in and you know that you're gonna be super busy the next week and it's gonna be nuts and you haven't had time to meal prep. I always look, tell people it's so much better to get ready for the week because if you're disciplined, the best way to be disciplined is to start with preparation. Because if you're prepared, discipline is just easy. So the easiest way to be disciplined is to be prepared. But if you don't have time to be prepared, discipline can kind of go out the window. But what I've learned with traveling as much as I do, I mean, let's be honest, I live in a motor home. I have a house that's on wheels. I've traveled a ton over my lifetime. Um, with the company that I used to work with, uh, with Jason Phillips, um, we would travel every other weekend. And when I was training to go to the games, I lived in a different place every single year. I lived in Airbnbs, I lived in people's uh, spare bedrooms, I lived on people's couches. I did whatever I had to do to make myself be in a good position to be able to train. And so I was always in a different situation. So I just have a ton of tricks to make sure that I'm prepared, even in chaos. So what I did, I came home, I slept in so that I could get my sleep, um, even though um, my sleep was at a different time because I didn't get in until midnight. Then I ran to the grocery store and I didn't get my normal food where I'm gonna like meal prep and all that. I got quick foods for this week. So I wanna show you what, like you can go to the grocery store and make your meal prep fast. So one of the things I do is I pick up a rotisserie chicken. So that way I don't necessarily even have to meal prep. I'm gonna take this chicken apart, go ahead when it's warm, pull the, um, the actual skin off and just pull the chicken apart, put it in a container and then I will go ahead and weigh it when I'm ready for it for all the different meals I want it for. I went ahead and grabbed the, um, the non-breaded chicken wings, the hot and spicy non-breaded chicken wings from Publix. And I actually use those and I just throw them right back in the air fryer. And uh, if you look them up on uh, your app, you can just throw those in the app and I'd eat four or five of those to fill in the gaps for the protein and fat. And it's a quick snack <clears throat> to get in your protein and fat. And the other thing that I grab that's super fast guys is to make wraps. These are sweet potato wraps, they're gluten free. And then this was already prepped because I'm in a hurry. At Publix, they have boar's head chicken and turkey that you don't even have to wait in line inside the um, area where they have this, where you wait in line and you ask them. They already have this stuff pre-made. So I just grabbed a couple bags real quick and I was ready to go. And this was right beside it. Um, the other thing I did was I grabbed a big, huge bag of mango and um, blueberry smoothie mix, um, frozen, and I'm gonna make smoothies for breakfast because it's super fast. Throw my protein in there in the morning, blend those up with my uh, magic bullet, and then I'm gonna freeze this baby spinach. So I have the frozen fruit that I grabbed. I'm gonna freeze this spinach and then I have my uh, level one protein that I'm gonna add in there for breakfast. Also for breakfast, as you guys know, I'm gonna have my coffee with my level one protein and my collagen. Um, I always throw this French vanilla collagen in my coffee um, and that helps me. And then I've actually used the level one uh, blueberry muffin uh, protein for my coffee in the morning. So that makes things super fast. The other thing I did is I went ahead, I'm not gonna like prepare and cut up a bunch of fruit. Um, so I went ahead and I grabbed bananas. They're fast, you can grab them, run out the door with them. And normally, it's funny, normally I don't eat bananas, but when I'm in a hurry, I know that I'm gonna be running around. I, I have bananas on hand. 
I went ahead and instead of grabbing a whole pineapple that's cheaper and cutting it myself, I grabbed pineapple that was already cut up. I grabbed cherries because these are easy. You can count them at the end of the day if you haven't had time. Um, these can be your end of the day carbohydrates. Um, if you're running behind and you need an extra five, 10 carbs, you can eat a couple of these and make sure you get your carbohydrates on point. I also grabbed pre-packaged, um, it's like a quinoa mix for a carbohydrate mix because I'm just in a hurry and I don't have time to really think about things. Um, also grabbed um, some extra frozen uh, things. So frozen zucchini, frozen peas, frozen peas, frozen zucchini real fast. And I'm just gonna take these and I'm actually gonna put the um, rotisserie chicken with these, with just some sauce that I had in the refrigerator to make a really, really fast meal. Not anything exciting, doesn't really matter. Um, and then lastly, I have um, salsa that I hadn't opened in the fridge and um, my vegan um, cheese sauce that I use on a regular basis. And to be honest, I just grabbed some exotic potato chips. So I like these because they don't have a ton of different things in them and I wanted something crunchy, something different um, and grab these really fast. Um, and they have uh, sweet potatoes, Yukon gold potatoes, canola oil, safflower, yeah, safflower oil, sunflower oil, sea salt, beet juice, and then like a concentration and color. Like there's nothing really super horrible inside these chips. So I wanted something a little different. But guys, like don't make it complicated. Make it super simple. And if you're running behind, just grab something that's fast. Um, so I just know like this week's going to be a little crazy because it's a squished week. I was traveling. And so that way I have my protein done. I can throw like a shake together for breakfast really fast. I can throw protein in my coffee for breakfast really fast. Lunch is probably going to be a wrap dinner. I'm going to have some protein thrown with the quinoa or thrown with the vegetables that I got that are frozen, heated up in the microwave. No, it's not perfect. No, it's not gonna be like gourmet, but I will reach my goals this week. I'm gonna move, probably not gonna have makeup on, my hair's gonna be a little messy, gonna be real, gonna be raw, probably not gonna have all the laundry done, but guys, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna hit my numbers. I'm gonna drink my water. I'm gonna move, I'm gonna sleep. I'm going to be an athlete, but I'm also going to be an entrepreneur and I'm going to get my stuff done. I'm going to reach my big island goals and I'm going to make sure that no matter what, I love myself enough to show up for me. I continue to develop my self-discipline and I continue to step into that power and choose to show up instead of allowing life to happen. And I say, oh, life happened this week and I couldn't do it. We always have a choice, guys. You always have a choice of whether you want to say life happened or I built the life that I want. And I want to invite you guys, if you want to join a tribe of people that are building the life that they want, that's what we do inside the FLA movement. That's what it's all about. All we do is we hand you some tools. We empower you to become a weapon and we stand beside you while you go after whatever dream it is that you have, whether it's aesthetics, whether it is a performance goal, or whether we need to change and transform your health. And we basically just all go after our goals together. We run, we move, and we transform together. So love you guys, talk to you soon. This is Chastity and uh, Ollie's down here on the floor with me. FLA Movement, I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a great day.